preparations for the opening ceremony and you are not helping. Relax, I'm just practicing my winning face. Your winning face? Yeah, you know, when everything is in slow-mo and you barrel through the finish line and you're all like... <laughs> like this! <laughs> You want to be a winner, you need to visualize winning. And as team captain for the Small Mart, I want all of you to do the same. Now, drink this. Oh, what on earth is that? It's a cheeky charge up made from milk, spinach, kale, and the tears of all my competitors that I've beaten over the years. You collect tears? That's like kind of weird. <laughs> Welcome to the first official Shopville Games. We have shoplets competing from all across Shopville, including the toy store, sports store, music store, tech town, fashion boutique, and the small mart. Please stand for the Shopkins National Anthem, sung by our very special guest, Miss Cupcake Queen. <clears throat> Shopkins, Shopkins, da, 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 da. No, Shopkins! Breathtaking, absolutely breathtaking. I have chills. Mainly because it's slightly cold today, but also because of that performance. Which leads us to our first official event. Yolanda Yo-Yo diving first for Team Toy Store. What an incredible display of shop lattices. A disappointing dive from Max Saxophone. And saves it by finding the key the judge lost in the water fountain three months ago. Now, for Team Small Mark. Show us proud, Lippy. Hold on. I'm going to get wet if I jump in there. No, thank you. Too cold. Lippy Lips fails to jump. Now, for Team Sport. Simultaneously taking out the gold medal in both the water fountain diving and ice skating event. What a win! I can't believe you did that to the team, Lippy. You're benched! <gasps> so, what does that mean exactly? Is there an actual bench that I have to sit on? Oh, yeah, it's just that one over there. You know, it's actually quite comfortable. But I'm still not happy about this! Shopkins, Shopkins! Have you got it? Are you recording? Oh! Oh my gosh, Shoppies! I have so much to tell you! So much has happened in the last few days! We met the sweetest new Shopkin named Susie Sunday! Oh, um, hi! <laughs> and we have moved to the most foodtastic place ever! Shopville! We just love it here! Some of us more than others. <laughs> Who knew there was such a great big world outside the small mart? But I have to tell you, leaving wasn't the easiest decision for everyone. Come on, Cheeky. I promise nothing outside will hurt you. Um, if you say so. <laughs> Ow. Inside, however, is a different story. <laughs> She's okay now. There's so much here to see and do and learn. Like, what's that? Ah, uh, you mean the stationery store? Stat Ion Airy? Huh, sounds fascinating. Wow! Well, that's all for now. I can't wait to share our new adventures with you. Check, Check you, you later. later. Bye. Shopkins, Shopkins! Don't you just love today? It just fills your heart with love. Yup, nothing can ruin the mood I'm in. Lippy, what is oh that? Lippy, you're as beautiful as fresh toast, with lips as red as um, beetroots. <laughs> Will you be mine? Say you'll be mine. No way. Cookie or oh cookie. <laughs> Sacre bleu! Could I be losing my charms? Oopsie. Ah! Bonjour, mon chéri. Would you give moi the pleasure of dinner? I'm not hungry. But, Beller, I can feel it in the air. 
All the signs are pointing to you and I together. You feel it too. No, this needs to stop. I agree. He doesn't look like he'll give up anytime soon. Uh, what if we ask him out? What? No, she's right, and I've got just the plan. So, are you going to tell us this plan? Oh, right. Well, you go over this way and then we go over here. Where are all of my beauties gone? My little toasty snookums. Won't you sing for me again? Why, well, hello there, my sweetie. I knew you could not resist these charms. No, me. Mwah, mwah, ah. mwah. Doughy bear. He's mine. He's mine. No, he's, no, mine. he's mine. mine. No, mine. mine. He's mine. Come down. mine. Oh, no. I must flee before their love for moi destroys us all. Au revoir, my love. <laughs> Check you later. <laughs> Ready? Ready. Fold the paper in half, staple four times, fold this bit here, add some butter, fold that bit there, turn upside down, fold the wings down, bend the wingtips back up, do the hokey pokey, and voila! The perfect paper plane! Easy! Now, your turn. Fold the paper in half, staple two times, fold these bits there, dip it in butter, turn it around, bend the bendy bits back, add some hokey pokey, and voila! Uh, at least it has wings! Coming through, guys! Get ready for takeoff! Forget my plane in the sky! Whoa! Ah! Apple! What do I do? I know how to make them! I don't know how to fly them! Uh, hold on to the sides and lean left and right to turn! Whoa! Nice work, Strawberry! Phew! Oh no! Whoa! <laughs> Love is in the air. Phew. Oh. Check you later. Shopkins, Shopkins. Shopkins! Whoa! What do we do now? We're gonna have to take this search to the sky. I'm going to track down Milk Bud via satellite. I just need to pinpoint our coordinates. I could use some help. Are any of you good with computers? I know how to do a smiley face emoticon. Never mind, we're just about there. Ah, this always happens to me when I'm about to do something really important. Hey, Mel T, helping my new friends find their dog. BRB. Can you hear me now, Tosti? Oh, maybe my phone's broken. Oh, oh no! no! I'm really sorry, guys. We should go check if Apple's okay. Lola, are you all right? I'm fine. The bush broke my fall. Seems like the greenery is saving a load of Shopkins today. How about you, Apple? You okay? <laughs> I'm so sorry. Are you hurt? No, it's not that. I was chasing after my dog, Milk Bud, and now he's gone, and I don't think I'll ever find him. Oh, no. I'm so, so sorry. I just miss the way he likes to be scratched behind his ears. I miss taking him out for walks. And I miss playing fetch with him. Playing fetch, huh? Yeah, he loved it, but we lost his ball, and... Now we've lost him. <laughs> well, if I were a dog who loved playing fetch and I lost my ball, I know where I'd go. Let's go, gang. We've got a furry friend to find. This moment calls for a celebratory game of fetch. Who's in? Yeah, I'm in. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Go along, milk bud. Ugh. Oh no! I think we'll just buy another ball. Check you later. Chi? 
Kiki. Oh, hey, Apple. I'm practicing my betrayal face for when I run into Lippy. You know she's right over there. Hey, Lippy. Uh, Yoo-hoo. Hey, no fraternizing with the competition. Come on, Cheeky. All this competitive talk is driving us apart. We're not even performing well because we're not working as a team. You're right. We've been losing because I've been too focused on you guys performing well rather than my own performance. Pretty sure that's not what I meant. If this team really wants a fighting chance at winning, then I have to step up and compete in all of the events by myself. That's the exact opposite of what I meant. Paul! Cheeky Chocolate takes home the gold for Team Small Mart! <sighs> going to beat you. Connie Console wins with a devastating 100 to nil victory in the soccer video game category. Now, for the long events. First off, the long jump. Long distance running. And finally, the long-distance phone call. Oh, hey, Cheeky. I'm actually right here. Ugh. Mushy, mushy. Lippy Lips wins for Team Fashion Boutique! The third day of the Shopville Games has come to a close. Let's take a look at our leaderboard. It's a dead heat between the Small Mart, Sports Store, and Fashion Boutique. This is tense, folks. It all comes down to the last event of the Games, the Shopville Relay. Who will win? No, honestly, that's not a rhetorical question. I literally have no idea. Who do you think's gonna win? Anybody? Hello? Saw Kuki. We were inside the small mart. I received a call from Lippy, but when I returned, she was gone. Cheeky Watson, we have one hour to find Kuki before it's too late. Oh no, why is that? I've got a dance class with Susie. I hope she's okay. Don't worry, Strawberry. We'll crack this case wide open. And we just gotta step closer to solving it. Okay, it was me. I knew it. So, where's Kookie? Huh? I don't know where Kookie is. I thought you guys were talking about the mess. I ran away because I didn't want you guys to think I was so clumsy all the time. Too late for that. Then where on earth is... Hey, guys. Kookie! Hey. Where have you been? Shut up, though. Oh, why didn't we think to look there? This get up in that heat? No, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Check you later. Shopkins, Shopkins. <laughs> hey, Strawberry, did you fall in the pond again? No, but Milk Bud did. Milk Bud! I didn't mean that type of shake. Sorry, Strawberry. What are you up to, Apple? I'm teaching Milk Bud new tricks. Milk Bud, shake. Oh! Good boy, Milk Bud. He got the right shake this time. Oh! Yay! What else can he do? He can do everything. Milk Bud, sit. Roll over. Speak. Oh, oh. Speak French. Oh, bonjour. Je m'appelle Milk Bud. Oh. Make a balloon. 
balloon animal. Bud, what is X when 2X equals 5 billion to the power of infinity divided by the distance between Shuffle and the moon minus the stick of butter plus Cookie's favorite number? Yeah! Woo! And now, the most difficult trick of all. Fetch the stick! Sacre bleu! Close enough, I guess. <laughs> Check you later. Dressing up as Rudolph this year, Cheeky? No, I fell face first into a bowl of cherries. You mean my cherries? I needed those, Cheeky. I know we need to move as quick as we can, but try to be careful, guys. How's the snow going, Susie? OMG, it's a winter wonderland in here. This snow is, like, super swirly, though. That's whipped cream, Susie. So that means I've served my pie with a side of canned snow. How classy. We need help, Apple. We've got so much food to prepare before Christmas Day, not to mention everything else that needs to be done. Hey, gang, what's all the fuss? Hey, Fleur, it's the Christmas rush. Guys, I think I let this sit too long and now it's turned to mush. Sorry, Fleur, we're a little stressed. I'll say you've made a mess. From the stuffing to the pudding, the list just never ends. There is no need to stress when you've tried to do your best. All you need is good old-fashioned help from your friends. We'll cook a Christmas feast filled with all sorts of treats. A really yum selection of savories. And sweets. What's that? It's really tasty. It's custard baked and pastry. Mm, you guys have got to taste this gravy. Sarah to live thicken. While we help you hang the ribbon. I don't know what I'm doing! Just follow what is written. I'll take care of the chopping. While we hang up all the stockings. Just be careful in the kitchen, cause the sink is stuff of clogging. Once we finish baking. We'll help with decorating. I spilled sauce on me. Don't forget to wear your apron. We'll be done in time for dancer. Dasher, fix, and prancer. Uh, who like ate the food we left for Santa? Sorry, I feel awful. As long as you're remorseful. All this food makes me hungry. <gasps> nope, nope, that's a bauble. We finished all the cooking from the stuffing to the pudding. Now it's time to hang the star. Just, Just be, be careful, careful of your, your footing. footing. We've done our shopping spree. Wrap the gifts under the tree. Now we can finally relax. But you forgot about me. Shopkins, Shopkins. Welcome to the Shopville Speedway. What a day it is to be racing. Perfect conditions on the track for our three competitors. Toasty Pop, Cheeky Chocolate, and Strawberry Kiss. Who do you think is going to bring home the championship title? Eh. You're absolutely right, Kooky. Who knows who will win? It could be anyone's race. And we're off! Strawberry Kiss pulling ahead with an early lead. Follow closely by Cheeky and Toasty as we enter Shopville. Now that's how you burn rubber. Oh, oh no, it looks like we have a slip on the track. Chocolate moves into first place. What a race! Whoa! Looks like we need to clean up in aisle three. 
Make sure we have plenty of chips for everyone, Buncho. This New Year's Eve party is gonna be awesome! Plus, we're gonna stay awake for the first time until midnight. Midnight? Oh, that means I'll only get 14 hours of beauty sleep. I'll start to look like all of you. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? Oh, uh, nothing. Eight hours. <sighs> I'm like already kind of tired just thinking about that. Don't yawn, because if you yawn, I'll yawn. Uh, uh oh. Stay strong, Cheeky. You're about to set off a chain reaction of yawning. The fate of this evening lies in your mouth. before the party tonight. I've written up a list of tasks for everyone to complete. What are you organizing, Apple? That! Now we can have a big New Year's Eve countdown. Who wants to see a 30-foot minute hand? Oh, yes, that's awesome. Do. That is Absolutely. so cool. That'd be so cool. So, like, does time go slower because the clock is so bad? Still the same speed, Susie. Since you ruined Christmas for me, I'm gonna ruin New Year's for you. Uh. <laughs> a great <sighs> party, mm, Apple. Hang in there, Susie. Not too long to go now. Ah! Happy New Year! Ah! Why are you all screaming? That's what you asked for, silly. I have to say, Apple, I'm not a fan of all this screaming. Makes me feel like a common garden weed. Spaghetti in the hole! Why did you do that? Well, don't get lippy with lippy. Do you know how hard it was to find a spaghetti cannon? It's not exactly a household item, Apple. What are you all looking at? Why, why, why would you do this? That's what you asked for. Earthworks. Fireworks. I asked for streamers, a confetti cannon, and fireworks. Let me see that list. Hey, somebody changed this. We're sorry, Apple. At least we still have the countdown clock. Hey, guys, it's nearly time. Ten, nine, eight, seven. What's that noise? I knew we shouldn't have stayed up this late. Where did the clock go? Uh, I don't know. Hey, you think it's been longer than ten seconds? Probably. Well, Happy New Year, I guess. Thanks, Frida. That'll be two dollars. Any chance I could get one of those, too? I'm really sorry about the other night. To be honest, I'm just jealous because you're a way better cook than I'll ever be. Thanks, Cheeky. We're getting closer to our goal, Gang! The cow has already been turned off, and I cannot apply makeup without adequate lighting. Oh, no! Spilt Milk gets back from her trip today. I forgot to tell her about the power. Hey, guys. I'm back. Hello? What happened to the lights? Is this the switch? <laughs> Relax, guys. Nothing can stop us now. Uh, except for that. <laughs> eh, it'll probably just be a light drizzle. I feel I spoke too soon! I have an idea! Follow me! Oh! You have to get creative with the ingredients you've got. So 
Rosie, grab as much flavored syrup as you can find. Hey, everybody! Get your ice cold storm slushies right here. Hey, do you have cola? Can I get a raspberry flavor? It feels good to have power again, although we need to be careful about our consumption. Totally. We should probably go to bed. I guess one more episode won't hurt. Definitely. I could watch another. I want to see what happens next. We could even finish the season. Check you later. <laughs> To pull off. And why is that now? Because there's a giant clock in the middle of Shopville counting down to her birthday. Plus, I'm kind of standing right here. Don't you worry your pretty little head, Jessie Cake. It's your birthday, so you needn't lift a finger. Party people, I hope you left room for dessert. My, oh my, who is this apple of my eye? Hey. Hey. Little Blake. Apple Blossom. You dance? I dance. Then why are we still standing here like a couple of mannequins? Girl, bring that beat back. Woo! Those moves are lit! Just like these candles. Yeah! Drop that core. Yeah. Get after it. Mmm. Ah. Uh, show me what you got. I don't have anything to show him. I, uh, I mean... I got the pudding for y'all, so, uh, enjoy. Okay, gang, let's take a break and enjoy some pudding. 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 